All right, what's going on, you guys? Nick here with Next on the Power. So just a quick news update video for you guys on Lou Ferrigno, actually. So a lot of you guys have been sending me um, some of these pictures that were posted of Lou Ferrigno in the hospital on his Instagram and on his Twitter. Um, a lot of people concerned about what might be wrong with him. So Lou Ferrigno, a couple of days ago, was hospitalized after a pneumonia vaccination. So he posted a picture on social media in his hospital bed, um, essentially with the caption, Went in for a pneumonia shot and landed up here with fluid in my bicep. I'll be okay, but it's important that you keep an eye on who's giving you the shot and make sure that they not only swab the spot correctly, but that you watch the needle come out of the package. So he was in the hospital as a result of this pneumonia shot, um, causing fluid buildup in his bicep. And based on the caption that he posted, he was in the hospital as a result of maybe the technique of the actual performance of the vaccination rather than the contents of the vaccination itself. Um, according to Dr. William Schaffner, the fluid in Ferrigno's bicep could have been a reaction to the vaccine or it might have been because the vaccination itself was not done properly. The skin might not have been appropriately disinfected before the shot or the needle or vaccine could have been mishandled. So while Lou Ferrigno was in the hospital for a couple of days, it's my understanding that he's actually out now um, and that he's okay. He did a follow-up post yesterday on Friday to let fans know that he was now out of the hospital and he uh, made it in time to do an event with Dolph Lundgren. So for everybody that was wondering, I believe Lou Frigno is currently fine. Now, the second story in this quick news update is actually also related to Lou Frigno. Now, this story is going to be about Lou Frigno's son, Lou Frigno Jr. Now, it appears that Lou Frigno's son is following in his father's footsteps. Um, he just landed his first ever superhero role in the DC series Stargirl. So Lou Ferrigno Jr. has been cast in this upcoming DC series in the role of a superhero um, called Our Man. So apparently this character, aka Rex Tyler, um, is described as a thrill-seeking superhero and a master chemist who can manifest super strength for just one hour a day. So it's kind of interesting because it's very similar sounding to his father's character, obviously Lou Ferrigno Sr. played the role of the Incredible Hulk in the 70s and 80s TV series. Um, obviously Lou Ferrigno um, in the Incredible Hulk was, you know, Bruce Banner, the scientist that could transform into this super strong green superhero, you could call it. So very similar in that regard that his son is now playing um, a superhero that's a master chemist that can manifest super strength. Um, kind of an interesting dynamic there. So it's kind of cool that we're seeing these bodybuilding legends like Lou Ferrigno and Arnold Schwarzenegger um, have their sons kind of follow in their footsteps and manifest what they did. Um, obviously, Arnold's son, Joseph Bania, is now pursuing bodybuilding. Now, Lou Ferrigno's son is now pursuing acting. I think it's pretty cool um, and really fun to watch. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Not a very long video today, just a quick update. Um, no 10-minute video today, but maybe tomorrow. Thank you guys for watching. Please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Nick Strength and Power, signing out.